Like and subscribe. <laughs> Yo, what we got here? <clears throat> All right, so I don't know if I. This is a race car. This is pretty much a race car at this point. <laughs> but uh, anyway, I'm trying to do. Uh, I'm trying to put a catch can right here. I have one here, but it's it's a little too small. It's still pushing like a little bit of oil out. But uh, this can be used in car audio as well, if for battery delete. I kind of started already, but I got these 516 uh, fast connects or whatever they're called. This one's using a factory bolt. I found this one I just screwed with some self-drilling metal things. And I'm gonna take all my wire and lug them and put it on there and have a blast and it's gonna free up this area for my new catch can it's gonna fit right here in lines you know come off and run to that such and such but let's try to do that today I got oh, I got a new the crimper I have doesn't go didn't go up to like two lot or whatever so I bought this like I don't know how much this was like 50 bucks on Amazon it looks pretty beefy and it comes with like gargantuan size lugs bought some lugs up there i bought these like little things to cover those just so it's not fully open and uh bought some pretty good lugs these are these are two odd i think this will fit like one odd car audio i got an eight gauge and a four gauge i think i got some one gate uh one odd ones coming in today that i might need but that's what we got and that's what we're doing today Yay! All right, I'm slowly making progress. Didn't want to bore y'all with the crimping and such. Got a new wire. I gotta put my fuse block wire there with my alternator wire right there. And then that's done for the positive. The cleanup down there, it's kind of gross. <clears throat> and then just my grounds are right here. Loop it underneath good to go this is a see it's so dumb i had so many different plans with this car so the original plan was just not sq but just daily don't worry about nothing no loudness i mean loud but like you know just whatever so i ran some four gauge this one this one right here oh something just touched Something just touched. I don't know what it was. But y'all heard it. Oh, that's what that was. The uh, This is going to the lithium. So this one is always... It's still connected to the lithium, so it was just finishing the connection. But I ran 4 gauge through that little bitty hole. Then I'm like, look, I'm going to need the sauce. So then I got the excess power. One not zero gauge and ran through a bigger hole right there that's a gas i mean a, a little cut through easy to push the ecu wires through and stuff but but no, but i have the four gauge no oh, it's just this train wreck i have the four gauge still running to like my fuel pump relay because i don't know so i'm just gonna run it all as it is and figure it out later make sure it starts and then giddy up maybe trim that wire down a little bit but i could push it into the car or pull it into the car but not not got it cut got it measured and uh <laughs> these are so goaty i'm sure there's better ones but these are so goaty and if you don't have if you don't just have these just thrown around your entire yard uh, you just you, you're not doing it right <clears throat> the beast is it on yeah one-handed
it. Boom. <clears throat> Makes it clean too. I have this other, that other crimper I had, it like it pinches the side. Nice. <clears throat> Plop that on. Bango bongo. That should be everything. I have to put a little grease on this. It kind of like doesn't stay because you're supposed to run a wire through there. But <clears throat> got them on there. Now let's do a live uh, start. <laughs> Hopefully it starts. If it starts, game on. Um, I don't see why I should know. They're all connected. They're all connected. Let's see. Well, <clears throat> I'll know if my uh, my light right here, I mean my noise right here is on. Oh, it's a good sign. It's a good sign. Let's see. There were some doubters that it would drain the battery cranking it let's see ho, ho, ho. cranker danker i'm gonna eventually put something better back there not not better but just newer back there instead of that juice box maybe a titan 8 uh titan 8 or a jy something small that does like you know five six k on like burp and then just daily like something like three four thousand i think one titan should be all right catch that stimmy money catch that stimmy money but that's what we're doing so battery delete further wind just have that lithium jy back there it's the only thing battery wise in the car now Eventually, I would like to clean up all the wires, but for now, it's all right. It did work, bro. Like shorten that one, run the cable thing over there. I don't know. But it looks good. It looks good and it functions. That's all that matters. And it's a nice spot for me to charge now. I was charging on my starter and this little bolt here, so now I can just go straight to these. <coughs> Pretty cool. So that's it now we pick up the tools and hopefully next week as soon as i get that as soon as i get that new catch can in i'll be good i mean i'm good now but i'll get that new catch can in i'll uh i'll move on to something else and i'll start some sbls but that's good for it that's good for now let me put the charger back on it Crank third up. Appreciate y'all. Like and subscribe. <laughs> Guys. Also, check out Everyday Audios. That's uh, me and Taylor Fade's podcast we do like once a week. We try to get it once a week. Tuesdays. Normally, we're at Tuesdays live, 6.15. Just talking about bullcrap. It's most of the time not audio. <laughs> but, you know, check it out. Check out the old episodes. See if you like it. But, I'm shut it off. Jake.